Fast and easy how to clear browsing history of your navigation on Chrome on your Samsung Galaxy phone is very easy. All you have to go is open your Chrome. Okay, now in the top we have three points. Open the three points and then go to history and then go to clear browsing data. And now you're gonna select if you want to clear all time or only what you were doing in the last 24 hours, seven days, four weeks, all time, all ago, and select clear data. And that's how you're gonna eliminate and clear browsing history on your Samsung. And your husband is not gonna see what you're doing on your phone. Very fast and easy. How how to hide an album in the Samsung Galaxy A04 or 5 is very easy. All you have to go is go to your gallery and then in the bottom you're gonna go to albums. If you tap the three tabs, the three points that are in the top, there's gonna be an option that says select album to show. So all you have to do is unselect the album that you don't want to show. If you go dumb, as you can see, that album is hided. If you go to the three points, select album to show and select the album again. Now the, the album is not hiding. It's so easy like that. How to remove screen lock with pattern in your Galaxy A05, A04 phone is very easy. First you go, you have to know what's the pattern you have to block this phone. So you go to settings. Now you're gonna find the lock screen option. And if you can see, we have the pattern option activated. So we enter and we must have and remember what is the pattern. So let's put in the pattern. Now we're gonna select the first option the which is swipe in this moment if i go back close the phone open the phone you can see that i have eliminated eliminated or disactivated the screen lock to the phone very fast how to create home screen folders on your galaxy a or 5 a or 4 phone is very easy all you have to do is select first you're going to select one option one app and you're going to try to move it around and then you're going to go and put it on top another app and then you're going to select go out select another app move it around and put it on the other apps now we are in a folder and here you can put your folder name subscribe subscribe okay you know what i have to um what i've got what i want you to do subscribe to the channel give me a like 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 and comment if this video was, was useful for you very fast and easy how to recover recently deleted photos and videos in your samsung galaxy a or 4 a or 5 very easy all you have to go do is go to your gallery and then normally you're here in your photos you're gonna go here in the three lines that are in the bottom okay now you're gonna select trash and now you're gonna select from all the photos that are here recently deleted or videos you're gonna select the one you want to restore or delete if you go delete you're not gonna restore or recover anything but if you go and select all this and you restore it this is how you do it very easy very fast and easy how to clear app cache on any app under galaxy a or 4, A or 5 or, or similar Galaxy phones, go to settings. Now you're gonna, let's go to apps, apps options. And now you're gonna find the app where you want to clear its cache. Let's see again, like an example, go to Chrome app, and then you're gonna find the option that says storage. It's in storage option. And then in the bottom, as you can see, clear cache, here you type or press clear cache and that's the easy way to clear apps cache to any app you want to remove its cache data stored in the phone very fast and very easy how to find my phone number on a samsung galaxy a or 4 a or 5 or similar galaxy phones there are two forms to do it the first one and the large is going to settings then going down about the phone and then going to status information and then first option sim card status and if it's not here your mobile phone go back go back this is the large the long way the short way is going to settings 
going up, going to connections, going to SIM manager, and here I can see what is the phone of this card. That's all you have to do. Easy, very fast and easy how to go and get more locker buffer on your phone and get your phone more faster. Go here to settings and now you're going to go down, down, down. You start here and up, you're going to go down and enter developer options. If you don't know how to enter developer options, find the video on my channel or in the first comment or in the description. Enter developer options and now you're going to find and look for logger cache. Logger buffer sizes. This is not the one. Logger buffer sizes. And you're going to play with this. And if you have a good ROM, good size of cache, you're going to go up. But if not, you're going to go down. So play with this and see how one of these options is going to boost your phone, making it more faster. Very fast and very easy how to enable always on display in a Samsung Galaxy A or 4, A or 5. Very easy. As you can see, here we have where all always on display in this display so let's get in the phone and let's show you how can we do this we must install an application and it's free this is the app you have to install all you have to do install the app give them the permissions and simply you have to do the config configure what you want to see in your all display let's change to this other option this one a number more bigger apply go out block our phone Activate always on display on a Galaxy low budget phone. Very fast and easy how to add the three buttons in the bottom of your Samsung Galaxy phone. If you have your phone in gesture mode and you don't like gesture mode, you want the three buttons in the bottom. All you have to do is go to settings. Now find the option of display. Now you're going to find, go down, go down and find the navigation bar. And now here is the option. What do you want? In this moment, it's in gesture mode or the three buttons. And then when you select the three buttons, you can now see the three buttons are in the bottom. And now you're going to select which is the order, this order or this order. And now you're going to select what's the way you are more comfortable for the three buttons. And you're going to subscribe to the channel. Give me thumb ups and comment. Thank you. Comment. Thank you. And see you next one.